Hello there! In this video, I am going to briefly show you how to use FlatLogic plus ChatGPT integration. With this integration, you literally can generate full stack CRUD web applications in minutes based on their description. So let me show you how to do it. As usual, I click Generate Web Application, type Application Lane, let's let it be Case Management System or Healthcare. Uh, I copy this to use as an application description, then choose a technology stack and on the next step, choose a template. On the next step, we need to define the database schema. So you can either do it yourself or generate it with OpenAI. So I can type the application description here. There are some few good examples, uh, so you can uh, use them as a reference, or I can simply type this uh, case management system for healthcare and let's check what it suggests. Okay, so here is it. So uh, it has patients table and counters and doctors. Let's make sure that everything here is good for us and then click proceed with the next step. We also need to specify label fields. They are used in drop downs and selects. And I believe everything looks good. The next step, I can push the generated application to GitHub and deploy it to our cloud. It will be available in a few minutes. Okay, so the application is ready and is deployed to the cloud. So here is it. Oh, it was showing me the model dialog with congratulations. Okay, here is, here is it, deployed to the cloud, uh, contains authentication, basic sign-in, sign-up mechanisms, uh, email notifications, reset password, and all of the tools uh, for us to manage our small hospital. Users, doctors, and counters, patients. So now as an administrator of the hospital, I can fill the tables of doctors, of patients, let doctors fill patients and encounters. So here is it, we generated the real full stack web application for case management with the real source code, now, not like low code, no code platform, but the true uh, application in a few minutes. So the source code is here. So feel free to leave your comments and thank you, bye.